These are the 10 best hiding spots in hide and seek that will not only keep you invisible from seekers, but will help you win the game almost every time. All 10 of these are very helpful and you will win every time if you use these hiding spots. But without further ado, let's get into the video. So this first hiding spot is going to be on the map Town Square. It's hard for seekers to find you up here since most of them don't really look up high. As you can tell, we already have a lot of people hiding up here with me, so uh, I'm pretty sure we're going to win this game. Now this next hiding spot is going to be on the map Gold Rush. It can be a bit tricky to get to, but really pays off in the end. Seekers don't really suspect that you would go somewhere like this. It's kind of hard to get to but it really pays off in the end of the game especially if you weren't found which you probably won't be if you use this strategy however even if you are found it's still kind of hard for seekers to be able to reach you unless if they do some parkour to get up here yeah most people should have a bit of trouble getting up here and if they do see you you can always just run away really fast and they probably won't be able to catch you hiding spot is actually also on gold rush now uh this is probably one of the best hiding spots that we've gone through so far because most people actually do not look over here surprisingly i didn't even know about this location but until i started recording this so uh, this is definitely one of the best places you can hide on this map because you won't see many seekers passing through here and if you do you probably will be able to run away because there are two exits honestly you can hide anywhere in this area it's just mostly a matter of staying hidden from behind this wall over here i'm going to show you the next hiding spot if you run over here behind this little wall this is actually one of the best hiding spots because people actually cannot see you i've actually never seen a seeker go over here before and if you're wanting to win on this map this is definitely the best hiding spot for you not only can you observe the whole map in third person mode but other people cannot see you if you're hiding here I personally think that if you're wanting to win this is definitely the hiding spot for you without further ado let's get into the fourth one this next hiding spot is going to be on the map office the reason this is so helpful is because you can actually shut the door on this map people don't even think about opening doors and hide and seek so this is definitely a good spot to hide but the only problem is is that it can be a bit difficult to get to i know it's kind of on the other side of the map from where you spawn so you just have to be fast and not get caught by any seekers while you're there but other than that this is one of my favorite hiding spots on this map but yeah let's get into the next one this next hiding spot is going to be on the map plasma even though it doesn't really blend in with your surroundings you're blocked by this huge structure right next to you that makes it so that people can't really see you most people don't really go around this way they just look in the room and leave if, if they don't see anything out of the ordinary so this is definitely a perfect spot if you can't find a good place to blend in or or you just want an easier route to get to it can be a bit hard to memorize but i personally think it's really worth it now this next one is kind of old but has always worked for me it's on the map hospital and it's really easy to get to you can just hide up here and most people don't actually think about going up here you really blend in with your surroundings and it just really depends on the seeker and if they're able to see you and the next spot is gonna be up on this map this is actually a really good spot because it blocks out the seeker's views from seeing you and it really just depends on if people care on looking up here <laughs> 